Welcome to Primo Race Center inside a brand new updated 2024 187RB here at Primo RV Center. This particular unit is a client's unit that will be uh, leaving us shortly. So just arrived, they'd ordered in. We've added some things on the exterior for them and soon we'll be handing the uh, keys over to them and letting them get started on their camping season for 2024. So up front, I mentioned we do have the Stargazer feature here. So you can see how much light this brings in. So certainly on a darker day, uh, the light is a huge aspect. But to me, when you get into that June, July, August, certainly September as well, when it's quite hot, if you open this up, especially when you're off grid, it just allows in a tremendous amount of air. And I like the setup the best on the 187 because just past that, you have a three speed out fan. So you can imagine if it's a hot night, you're wanting to evacuate that hot air from inside. You're gonna keep this open and then you've got the ability to put the bug screen across. Uh, we've got a separate video on it as well. So we'll show you the full functionality that you can have a look at as well, but it's just gonna give you just tremendous airflow. And then on top of that up front here, you've got cross ventilation here with the windows and then you've got matching huge windows in the middle. So one in the kitchen, one of the dinette, all of the same size. So by having those two features, uh, one is standard, one is an option. You're gonna move a lot of air, especially if you don't think you're necessarily always gonna be off uh, on grid, or if you'd like to take advantage of maybe those waterfront sites that aren't necessarily always powered, then this is a great feature to have that uh, stargazer. But we do carry both, so we carry it with and without, so you can always have a look. So we do have power on both sides of the bed, so both USB as well as 120 volts. So if anybody has a CPAP machine, you're gonna be fine. You're all hooked up here. You've got great storage. Uh, both above and on the sides for hanging items. Your huge front windshield, which will have a blackout uh, shade, as do all the windows here all the way around. So you're going to be able to easily pull those down. Again, you're going to be able to keep that light out, especially if it's maybe coming from one side. And again, great cross ventilation. You're going to have a 60 inch wide bed here, an RV queen length with uh, storage underneath for your bulk items, your extra bedding, your, your bags for the weekend. Uh, lots of storage there. As we come in, one of the interior changes for 2024, kind of new standard features, you're going to have a Bluetooth speaker rather than two exterior speakers, two interior speakers. So it's now a system you can take to your dinette inside, you can take to your picnic table outside, you can take to the beach with you. And so as it uh, docks, it's a charging station. And then you also have uh, USB hookups on the side as well. So you could charge another device off of it as well if you forgot your charger. We've got um, our awning switch here to be able to put out our awning. It'll go at a full eight feet. And then we've got our light underneath our awning here, uh, the switch here as well. Our dinette's great. So if you're looking for that, just one extra bed, either for an adult that might be just under six feet um, or grandchildren, which is always a very popular one, um, that's gonna make a great bed for them. So you've got some storage underneath there and that'll drop down very easily. And then into the kitchen. So something that a lot of clients have been asking for for several years, you now have a cutlery drawer. So the center here will be a cutlery drawer. This one on top is going to be a spot to be able to put your wet uh, cloth or sponge when you're done cleaning up before you head home. And uh, we've got a nice, again, very deep sort of farmhouse style stainless steel sink. So if someone's got a little one, you can almost bathe them in there. It's so, so deep. So we've got a nice high rise faucet here. And because everything's undermounted, full kitchen counter space. So something they did several years ago, which was a great idea. So even though it's a smaller kitchen, it's really, really functional. You've got your microwave just below that. Central furnace here, so if it is a cooler day, you're quickly being able to warm up the entire coach. On this side, you do have hookups for a TV. So whether it be future or right away, they let you know exactly where you can put the mount. So the idea would be that you could arch towards the bed as well as the dinette. It's something we can install just the mount for you. Or if you want a combination mount and TV, that's something we do quite regularly on the Nanos for clients, just depending on what their preferences are. You've got great storage for all your dishes just above some pantry storage above your 12 volt fridge, as well as beside. So it'll go back several feet here and it's nicely divided off pantry. So you've got a lip here so things don't come flying out at you as well. And then you've got the massive 12 volt fridge here. So great uh, eight cubic foot fridge being 12 volt is very deep rather than tall. So it gives you a lot of capacity in there, which uh, I appreciate. Somebody who has a bigger family, uh, more space in the fridge is nice because you can be out there longer. Your converter charger is uh, pre-set up for lithium batteries. So in the future, should you go that route, you do not have to change anything else. You're well set up for that. And the solar lends itself to adding more batteries as this client has, or in the future, upgrading to lithium. So wonderful bathroom here that runs that full seven and a half feet. You've got great storage for hanging items. So great spot to maybe hang a few shirts, you know, rain gear. You can certainly stash some boots in there as below as well to just keep everything kind of tucked away. But you've already got some hooks for towels and then great medicine cabinet storage. 
certainly tuck away some toilet paper and those things and keep a first aid kit in the medicine cabinet. You've got a fan as well with a vent in the bathroom so that you can vent out that humidity. And you've got a nice rectangular shower. So it gives you some elbow room in there as well. And with a nice skylight to give you a little bit extra height, but lots of light as well. Your monitor panel in here is just tucked inside the bathroom. So you can check on the levels of your tanks, how full your batteries are. You've got your water pump switch, and then you're gonna have your ignition for both propane and uh, electricity on your hot water tank. You can run both at the same time if you've got the ability, and that'll get you about 18 gallons per hour, or running one or the other, you're gonna get about six gallons per hour. So certainly enough for a couple showers before you hit the road. Just a wonderful couples coach that's gonna allow you to take those smallest campsites, you know, get into some areas like waterfront sites that you wouldn't necessarily be able to with a longer coach. And that's for us, especially last year, made it the most popular couples coach that we sell and the ability to tow it with such a wide range of vehicles, whether it be now or in the future, especially if you're maybe downsizing your vehicle in the future, it's a really, really versatile couples coach that our, our couples have loved for, for years. And each year it gets a little better, certainly by far the best version they've ever made uh, for this 2024 model year. We invite you down to Primo Center to come have a much closer look.